Hello everybody, I'm Dr. Kane. I help people with peripheral neuropathy get out of pain and back to doing the things that they love doing. One of the ways that I do this is by connecting you with the right people, the right products and services that can all help you get better. Uh, so today we're lucky to have Mike Grice. He's the COO of Boost Oxygen. Uh, he's going to talk to us about their, their products and, and a bit about oxygen therapy, which is very much a wonderful thing. I'd say it's probably one of the most underrated nutrients that, that we have for our nervous system. Something that can help us get better and, and reduce our our pain. So, so thanks for joining us, Mike. Hey, thanks for having me aboard. Appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. So, so first thing, I figured it would just be great just to learn a bit more about, about yourself, how you got involved in, the, uh, in the, the field of oxygen, supplemental oxygen. Well, interestingly, I, uh, I served 27 years in the Marines. And uh, after I left the Marine Corps, I did some nonprofit work. And as a result of that nonprofit work, uh, connected with Rob Nooner, who's the president and CEO of Boost Oxygen. Mm -hmm. uh, he brought me on board. And uh, started out as a vice president of sales, um, worked my way up uh, to uh, being the chief operating officer of the company. One of the things I saw when I was in active duty, traveling around the world in the Pacific Rim, Afghanistan, Iraq, was that uh, one thing I wish we had a lot more of while we were out and about was oxygen. I mean, it's very physically demanding to go out and do a lot of things that we did. One of the first things we did to uh, help out those who were injured was give them give them oxygen to help them recover. Uh, it's, I, I firmly believe in the product as, uh, as a concept, and I firmly believe that it's something that everybody can use more of. So um, that's why I'm doing what I'm doing. Yeah, awesome, fantastic. Uh, <clears throat> so it, it's, it's definitely something that is, is highly beneficial and it's becoming more and more utilized, whether it's a, just regular straight-up oxygen or – uh, oxygen with the ex exercise therapy. A lot of people with chronic pain are getting some uh, good relief. Uh, what, what I haven't uh, come across is if there's any or what would be the, the risks or, or potential side effects of someone using supplemental oxygen. Well, oxygen is an element. Uh, oxygen is something that we're all using all day, every day. Without it, we wouldn't be here. Uh, you can la last about you know, three to four weeks without food. You can last three to four days without water. You can only last three to four minutes without oxygen. Mm -hmm. So oxygen is, is absolutely crucial to life's functions. Um, in addition to that, oxygen is something that uh, traditionally had been available primarily through healthcare providers as a prescription product or from first responders, mm -hmm. and the general population didn't have access to oxygen that they could use for recreational purposes or for supplemental purposes. And that's something that we at Boost Oxygen have done is we've taken what is a very simple and elegant concept, which is providing someone with access to something that's, that's absolutely essential to life and very helpful. Every time you're winded, that's your body telling you you need more oxygen. Just like every time you're thirsty, it's your body telling you you need more water. You can buy a bottle of water. Now we make it available for you to get bottled oxygen. Yeah, that's fantastic. How, how do you compare the difference between the – uh, supplemental oxygen uh, that you provide versus the, the the pharmaceutical grade, or you know what someone would get if they're uh, if they got it through their their medical doctor. Well, oxygen is oxygen; it's an element, as I said. So, when you get right down to it, there is no difference. There's no special medical oxygen. There's no special special aviation oxygen or sports oxygen. It's all oxygen. The difference really comes in the concentration that it's delivered at. So for medical oxygen, it needs to be delivered at a rate of six liters per minute and at a purity of over 99.5% uh, oxygen. Our oxygen is, is packaged in canisters. See one right there. This holds about 10 liters of oxygen, and what it provides is uh, about 200 seconds of oxygen so a little over three minutes, well below the six liter per minute uh, threshold for medical oxygen. And we also bottle a concentration of 95% as opposed to 99.5% oxygen. Uh, functionally and effectively, you're, you, there's not a, a difference in how your body absorbs oxygen. Once it goes into your lungs, the oxygen is ex exchanged for carbon dioxide and other off gases, goes into your system. It's, this oxygen that we have at Boost Oxygen is used identically in your body as medical oxygen because it's really the same thing. Yeah. The only difference is the concentration we provide it at and the, the flow rate and the delivery system that we have. Okay. Very, very cool. Yeah, it seems to me that just 95 versus you know, 99, 99.5% uh, that it wouldn't, uh, wouldn't make that much of a difference in, in how people use it. So, um, yeah, very cool. Uh, in, in terms of how, how people can best use your, your product, do you have any 
uh, recommendations or, or protocols in terms of you know, how much to use, how quickly, the, I mean, how, how would you advise someone that, that's new to it? Well, it's very similar, as I alluded to earlier, it's very similar to drinking water. If you're not thirsty and you drink water, your body's still going to you're going to take that and absorb it, but you're not going to get the same effect than if you're walking through the desert and somebody gives you a bottle of water. Right. Oxygen is the same thing. You can you can utilize supplemental oxygen when you're fully oxygenated and your body will absorb what it needs and it will outgas. You'll just breathe out the additional oxygen. It's impossible to overdose on it. Um, however, if you are breathing hard, whether it's through exercise, whether you're traveling to higher altitude to go skiing, whether you're chasing your grandkids around, whatever it is that you're doing, which is causing you to increase your respiration, to start breathing hard, that's your body signaling that you need more oxygen. Mm -hmm. Then, and that's the best time that you can use our product. The best time you can use boost oxygen is use the, just place it over your mouth and exhale fully and then inhale. Do that a couple, three times until you start to feel your respiration start to decrease to go back to normal. Different people have different use rates. So if, if you are a, a competitive weightlifter or a, a, comp, a competitive uh, martial arts enthusiast and you're going in between bouts, you're going to use a lot more than someone who's just chasing their grandkids around the backyard. But it's still the same stuff. Your body still uses it the same. Your cells, your muscles, all of your systems need oxygen. And what we provide is access for everyone. Yeah, and that's a fantastic service because it's uh, I, I'm just yeah so so passionate about helping people find you know much more natural ways to help them with their neuropathy because most of the guidance that people are getting is just you know take these medications about all you can do and uh, and especially when like the one of if not the most important nutrients for the nerves in our body if we can have more of it we can assimilate it in, into our nerves uh, you know quite readily uh, this is definitely something that needs to become more more at the forefront people need to be at the very least more aware that they have this option to someone that can uh, that can help because like, there's so many people with peripheral neuropathy that they you know they walk for 10 minutes or whatever and then, and then they're in pain and they can't do it anymore and uh, and I really think that this is this is something that could can really help out a, a lot of those people so I'm um, very very much glad that you're that you're doing this you're providing this um, uh, the, this product is there um, where, where would people go to to get more information on supplemental oxygen and, and on your products and and how it could help them out Sure. The easiest thing is go to our website, which is www.boostoxygen, all one word, mm -hmm. .com. Uh, also, you can just go on Google and, and Google benefits of supplemental oxygen. There are literally tens of thousands of studies that show the benefits of, of use, utilizing supplemental oxygen, uh, whether it's for neuropathy, whether it's for uh, a variety of, of exercise induced uh, times when you need more oxygen. Uh, it's amazing what the, what oxygen has been shown to be effective for. Um, what we have is, is we've taken a, and created a consumer product so that anybody can access it and anybody can use it. Um, and it's something that you as, a, as an individual can purchase at Big Five Sporting Goods, uh, we're at Dick's Sporting Goods, we're at Cabela's, we're at, at Kroger, Kroger Grocery Stores in the Rocky Mountains, or you can get it online on Amazon or at our website. So, uh, uh, we're very proud of the fact that uh, our tagline is help is here because we're here to help uh, and we provide oxygen available for everyone. Yeah, that's fantastic. You know, I'll leave a link to the, to the website in the description for the video. So very cool. Well, yeah, I think we touched on the, on the major points here for supplemental oxygen and the importance of it. Is there, is there anything else you want to uh, leave the viewers with pertaining to supplemental oxygen? No, I think that uh, what you're doing with the introducing um, your, uh, patients and clients to, to innovative new uh, therapies is fantastic. Um, as, as I said, we're here to help. And anything that we can do to provide tools out there to help people with uh, just getting through their daily lives or exercising or whatever, we're happy to do. Yeah. So I appreciate the opportunity to chat today. Yeah, fantastic. Well, thanks for joining us, Mike. Thanks for everyone watching. And uh, for all you viewers out there, just make sure you continue to educate yourself. There are so many things out there, just like supplemental oxygen here, that can potentially help you with your neuropathy and that are not going to have the, uh, the toxic side effects of the medications that, you, that you're on. So, uh, so for all you viewers of neuropathy, stay relentless, and, and in time you'll definitely be in a, in a better place. And I definitely uh, recommend at the very least trying out supplemental oxygen and uh, see what it can do for you. So, all right, thanks for watching, everyone. Have yourself a wonderful day.